Birds have better eyesight than any other living creature. Although their eyes cannot move, they have other advantages that make up for this. This vulture, soaring high above the Michalisberg range, can spot any dead or dying animal on the plain below. At the same time, it can see other vultures far out of range of our normal vision. And when one of them starts its spiraling descend to a source of food, others will follow immediately from several kilometers away. Falcons, looking for their prey from vantage points, have eyesight eight times sharper than that of ourselves. This is because the retinas of their eyes have more visual cells. At the retina's most sensitive point, known as the fovea, a falcon may have as many as one and a half million visual cells, where we have only 200,000. From a distance, we would see a sparrow as nothing more than a blur, whereas a falcon, with its large number of visual cells, would see a much clearer picture. Falcons and other birds that chase their quarry at high speed have two foveas in each eye. We only see a small part of a bird's eye because the actual eyeball is extremely large and in most cases is actually larger than the brain. The eyeball of an ostrich, for example, is nearly as big as a tennis ball and is larger than any other land animal. Within the space, intricate focusing mechanisms come into play. Birds on the lookout for food, consisting of tiny insects or seeds, must be able to focus within less than a centimeter and at the same time keep an eye out for danger. This requires highly specialized focusing equipment, making it possible for them to focus from extreme close up to infinity in a split second. This thrush, cocking its head, is not listening for a worm, as some people believe. It is in fact focusing its eye to detect the movement of its prey on the ground. The eyes of birds like kingfishers and cormorants are specially adapted for hunting their prey underwater. The penguin is probably the best example of this. Completely adapted to find its food underwater, it can stay submerged for more than 18 minutes. In addition to normal eyelids, birds also have a nictitating membrane that protects their eyes from dust and other harmful influences. Owls can see up to 100 times better than human beings at night. Experiments have shown that in complete darkness, they can locate their prey by their excellent hearing ability alone. The eyes of the dukop are possibly just as sensitive. Owls have their eyes positioned at the front of their face, just like us. This gives them a wider range of binocular vision but they have to turn their heads if they want to see what's happening behind them. Because their eyes cannot move individually, birds often struggle to judge distance. This immature barn owl is moving its head from side to side in order to view its subject from different positions. By doing this, it gets a perception of distance. Shorebirds do this by bobbing their heads up and down to get different views of their subject in relation to horizon. Eye owls, all our hunting eagles, have eyes positioned at the front of their face. The eyes of most other birds are situated on the side of the head, which means that they can cover a much wider field, enabling them to see almost everything around them.